Hello everyone, Tragic MTG is back again to open more packs of Magic the Gathering cards. Uh, I've been doing this uh, a few times in a row here for this month. Um, so make sure to hit the like button if you like it, and the unlike button if you don't, whatever. Comment down below and check out my other videos. Thanks a lot, appreciate it. Let's get into this pack of Avacyn Restored. One of my favorite sets. This is the, the first set that I actually did a pre-release. Um, when I got back into Magic after playing just Kitchen Table Magic for a while back in the late 90s. Uh, here, this is after a long hiatus, got back into Avacyn and Innistrad. Gate Guards, Driver of the Dead. Oh yeah, and we will be scanning up the rare at the end. Let's do it. Timberline Guide, Explorer... Some creepy humans there. That's a creepy vampire. That's actually one of my favorite cards out of this set. Play Aristocrats with this Blood Artist. Great card. And it is $5.99. It sees a lot of play, I think. You got a Triumph of Cruelty, a Latch Seeker, and Riders of Gavany. Human Knight 3 3 Vigilance. As it enters the battlefield, choose a creature type. Creature, human creatures you control have protection from creatures of the chosen type. Anti-tribe. Keep those werewolves at bay. It is something that has been reprinted in Commander, and the original version is only 44 cents. That's all there is to it. I think I saw a foil. I got a forest. I got an angelic wall for a foil. There we go. All right. Next up is Journey into Nyx. Blood Artist. Whoops. I will take it. Come on. All right. Looking for gods. Which gods were in Journey into Nyx? I don't remember. Market Festival. Rotted Hulk. Hubris. Isn't that the truth? Pensive Minotaur. Very thoughtful Minotaur. Warring Siren. That's cool. Grove Dancer. Flurry of Horns. The Lampads. Fortifier, Consigned to Dust, Spiteful Blow, Forgeborn Oreads, and Hypnotic Siren. You can, for one, it's a 1 1 with flying, and you can control, well, and you can bestow it to control Enchanted Creature, and then it gets a 1 1 that has flying. Um, that's a pretty high bestow cost, but I mean, that's a good way to control a creature, right? 50 cents, and nothing much else. Okay. Conspiracy. Take the crown if you can. I uh, never got to play Conspiracy like when it came out. This was when I was not playing. Interesting concept. Um, give, give it to Wizards. They're very inventive with the way that they can play this game. Got a mnemonic, mnemonic wall. Fiery Fall. Raise Dead. Color of Gales. Fade into Antiquity. Kill Shot. Yep. Oh, Evolving Wilds. We just need so many of you. Thorn of the Black Rose. Human Assassin, Death Touch. When it enters battle, you become the Monarch. That seems like a good deal. Nessie and Asp. Beast Within. I'll pull that one and check it out. Smuggler Captain with the Conspiracy Border. So I must do some Conspiracy stuff. And we got a Dragon Lair Spider. And a Weight Advantage as an actual Conspiracy. So... This Dragon Lair Spider has been reprinted. Looks like this was the reprint. It's a buck eighty-six, and a Beast Within. Another one that gets reprinted a bunch. It is a buck fifty-five. We'll take that one. So these conspiracy cards, they're only good if you're playing the conspiracy mode, like through draft. So they don't really rate very much. There we go. Konzatar Kier. Chance at a fetch land. Although the last pack that I opened, which was on a previous video, I think I got one. If you, Hopefully you're seeing this in the right order. We've got Canyon Lurkers. Glacial Stalker. Shambling Attendants. A Sultai Scavenger. Well, he's only a black creature. He's not a Sultai color creature. Lens of Clarity. Sands, 
Got an Abzan Battle Priest. Mystic Monastery. I'm gonna I'm gonna scan this one because I'm not sure. Okay, no, it's it's okay. But we got a Tamir Charger and a Mantis Rider. Flying Vigilance Haste. Um I think I, I like it. It's actually over a buck. I'm happy. I think that's a cool card. There we go. Moving on then to the next pack is Corset. Ninth, it's the ninth edition. Yeah. So all this stuff is coming out of boxes um, that I own. I'm just slowly going through it. Some some of them are loose packs, but this one was out of a box. So I don't see any. I don't see a full card there, but hey, that's how it goes. You know, always get one. Got a piker. Got a turtle. Got a spider. This is all just like the basic corset stuff, right? You get some knights. Pretty pretty vanilla knight, even though it's got vigilance. There's a hill giant. It doesn't get any more vanilla than that. Demystify. Destroy target enchantment. Feeblement. Yeah, it's all super basic stuff that you just need to kind of basically get into the game. A giant growth. You don't see this art too often, right? Got a fish liver oil. Angel's Feather, Diabolic Tutor, I'm actually going to scan this one, Whip Sergeant, We've got a Plains, and, oh, ooh, ooh, that's not basic, We've got a Phyrexian Arena, very nice. So the Diabolic Tutor, I've noticed, has come up in price, I'm guessing it's commander driven, um, four mana to search your library for a card, put that into your hand, it's, you know, it's an expensive demonic tutor, that's probably perfectly acceptable in in commander so this card is coming up in price I believe Let's see if I can get it to scan yeah it's a buck 28 this was bulk for a long long time I mean, maybe it hit 50 cents in the last couple years but now it's coming up Phyrexian Arena at the beginning of your upkeep you draw a card and you lose one life it's the fight of the bobs right there and this printing is the ninth edition printing 22 bucks. So that deserves a sleeve. There we go. Very nice. Pretty good pull out of 9th edition. After a quick pause, I found that Phyrexian Arena is the 5th best card out of 9th edition. There you go. Alright, on to Planar Chaos. From back in the day. Giant Dust Wasp. Dead and gone. Deals two damage and return target creature you don't control. Let's check it. Choices are nice to have, but uh, apparently that one doesn't get used a lot. We got a Kusite and a Dawn Charm, which I don't think this one ever hits over 90 cents. Yeah, it's 50 cents, pretty good for a common. Uktabi Drake. Look at the art on this. That's pretty cool. Deadly Grub. Dust Corona. Prodigal Pyromancer. That's a pretty cool callback to the Prodigal Sorcerer. Vampiric Link. This one might be a little bit. Let's check it. It is a little bit. Piracy Charm. I don't think that's much. Stone Cloaker. I'll check it. I'm not sure. Sometimes I gotta check these and I'm not positive. Venarian Glimmer. Harmonize. I think that's pretty decent. And a Magus of the Tabernacle. Harmonize. 76 cents is okay. Magus of the Tabernacle. It's a buck 56. All creatures have at the beginning of your upkeep sacrifice this creature unless you pay one. That's an interesting stacks effect. There you go. Alright. Cold Snap. Is that, is that stacks or tax? Comment down below. Because I'm not positive where you would want to play that. Squall Drifter. So we got some snow creatures here. Elemental. Task Mage. Snow Covered Mountain. So we'll scan that one up. But being a buck 47. Chill to the Bone. Rhyme Runner. He's snowboarding. Like a rune covered snowboard. Surging Might. Martyr of Spores. I think the white martyr is pretty good. Carpluzen Wolverine. Feast of Flesh. Man, that was gnarly. Whatever's going on there. Kravakin Mist. Keldoran Warcry. There we go. Tressorhorn Sinks. 
I'm gonna scan that one. It's almost a buck. Rhymehorn Orox. Ursine Philgia. How do you say that? Philgia? Cool looking spirit bear. And then the rare is Lightning Serpent. For X and a red, it's an LML server 121. Trample Haste. Comes into play with X plus one plus zero counters on it at the end of the turn. Sacrifice it. Wow. So it's got the, the hasty lightning. Is that like lightning elemental, lightning ball effect there? Lightning serpent. Let's check it. It's a buck 37. There we go. All right. That is my packs for today. Uh, I'm pretty happy with them. Hope you guys are too. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you on the next one.